Welcome to this demonstration of how Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 can be used to optimize customer engagement and the customer experience. In this scenario, we'll experience a day in the life of Lisa Andrews, Customer Experience Manager for AdventureWorks. We'll follow along as Lisa uses Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 to track call center statistics, manage caseloads with queues, deliver consistent customer dialogues, and track follow-up with customers. As Customer Experience Manager, Lisa needs to ensure that AdventureWorks is resolving cases in a timely and accurate manner. To get a 360-degree view of the case activity in her department, she can use the dashboard capabilities in Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011. At a glance, Lisa can see that customer satisfaction is relatively high, yet agents are still working to resolve quite a number of cases. She is concerned by the information in the Cases by Priority graph which shows that Varun has a significant amount of high-priority cases. Lisa clicks the List icon at the top of this graph to open the cases represented in the chart. She now can see all the active cases with a summary visualization right within the dashboard. This inline visualization allows Lisa to filter the active case view in real time. For instance, to see only the high-priority cases assigned to Varun, she clicks the blue segment of the bar above his name. To identify the degree of urgency of these cases, Lisa selects Created On. Next, she adjusts the graphic to her preferred style of presentation. To help offload some of these cases from Varun, Lisa decides to add them to a new queue so that other agents can take them on and help reduce the backlog. Queues provide a way to streamline service processes by prioritizing actionable items based on specific criteria, such as severity, date received, and more. To select the range of cases she needs, Lisa clicks the checkbox of the oldest case, holds down the Shift key, and selects the case created on the 12th of October. Now she will add these cases to the new queue to spread the caseload across a wider range of representatives. Lisa adds these cases to the High Priority Service Cases queue. The oldest cases have now been added to the queue. Once each case is accepted from the queue by a call center agent, ownership of the case is transferred to the new agent. This will leave Varun with a much more manageable workload. Even though Lisa is the Customer Experience Manager, she assists in working on and resolving cases. With just a couple clicks, Lisa can pull up her cases. Right from within Microsoft Outlook, she clicks My Active Cases to view her open cases. Lisa sees her active cases sorted by the date they were created. The conditional formatting feature in Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 makes it easy for her to identify overdue cases because those cases are displayed in bold. She can also open the chart pane to view her data in a graphical format. Lisa wants to make sure she is working on her highest priority cases, so she clicks the blue section of the bar. This filters her cases in real time Lisa decides to work on the broken product case. Another powerful feature of Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 is called Workflows. Workflows allows organizations to automate business processes and routine tasks. This helps workers be more efficient and cuts down on data entry. At Lisa's company, when the category for a case equals broken item, then the broken item case routing workflow automatically assigns the case to a broken item queue and sends a confirmation email message to the customer. This allows AdventureWorks to immediately acknowledge receipt of the case without requiring service representatives to manually create email receipt notifications. Lisa can quickly verify that the workflow generated email was sent to the customer. To help ensure a consistent, high quality experience for customers, 
AdventureWorks service agents are provided with scripts or dialogues to use when resolving cases. Scripts can also serve as a way to guide a service agent through a new upsell or cross-sell opportunity, such as a new product or service offering. Scripts are implemented in Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 using the new dialog feature. For this case, Lisa launches the troubleshooting dialog. The dialog provides Lisa with guidance on how to interact with this customer on the phone. She can capture details about the broken product and specify whether the customer desires a refund or replacement. The dialog has identified the customer as an important gold customer and the script automatically reflects this by instructing Lisa to offer a $50 gift voucher. The dialog also displays data from Microsoft Dynamics CRM, such as the customer's address, so she doesn't have to open another record just to find that information. Lastly, the script provides Lisa with instructions to help the customer return the damaged item. When the call is complete, the workflow sends a summary email to the customer. By opening closed activities, Lisa can see the email message that the dialog generated. In this case, the email also contained an attachment with how-to information to help the customer with the replacement process. The dialog also generated a task reminding Lisa to send the $50 voucher to this important customer. Once she has sent the voucher, she marks the task as complete. All this activity history is centralized in Microsoft Dynamics CRM within the case record. Next, Lisa can resolve the case. She notes that a replacement was processed and clicks OK. Resolving the case closes and locks the case with the historical data intact. This is important for customer service agents who may have to go back and review a case's service history. Now that Lisa is finished here, she can work on other high-priority cases. As you've just seen, Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 is a powerful tool for optimizing customer engagement and the customer experience. Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 helps customer experience teams manage caseloads, deliver consistent dialogues, track follow-up with customers, and much more. Thanks for watching. For more information, contact your Microsoft representative.